Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel and today's tutorial is going to be on how to create a business card from a document that you um, upload to your Cricut Design Space from your computer. So I'm going to go to upload, I'm going to go to upload image, I'm going to go to browse, I'm going to go to my image that I have, the image needs to be in PNG. SVG. I'm going to open that. It's going to bring me to my Cricut Design Space. And I'm going to go to Complex. I'm going to go to Continue. And then I'm going to take my eraser. And I'm going to erase the whole background so that it becomes transparent. I'm going to go into Continue. I want to save as a print then cut because this is exactly what I'm going to do then I'm going to take that image and I'm going to upload that image I'm going to try it again I'm going to take that image <laughs> and I'm going to insert the image and it will come out like this. Now, for anyone that does not know what the standard business card dimensions are, it is a 3.5 by 2.0. So what I want to do is I want to go to the width size and I want to make sure that it is set as a 3.5. And I want to unlock the middle button in between because this allows me to adjust the sizes as I would like. I'm going to make the height at 2.0 and then I'm going to lock it back so that it does not go anywhere. It won't move. 3.5 and 2.0 is what my diameters or length and height and width would be. So once I finish with that, I'm going to move that to the side. I'm going to go into shapes and I am going to click on the square. I want to create the same size with this, so it'll be 3.0, and it'll be, I'm going to unlock that, then it's going to be 2.5, 2.0, sorry. 3.5 and 2.0 is the standard size for business cards. Okay, so I want to make sure that I have this set to print. Oops, let's go back. I want to make sure again that I have this set to print because that is exactly what I'm going to do. I want my fill also to change to white, okay? make sure that my diameters are right okay so I have that and now I want to create my text now I have done this before so okay so once I have the text of what I want to put on my business card I am going to make sure that it also has print here it has print here and it also has print here um, this is what I use again as a guide as to what I want to play start moving things into placement so I'm going to place my text exactly how I want it to go on my card and then I'm going to move, go to arrange and hit move forward to bring the image forward and just make adjustments as far as the sizing and how you need things to be. Let 
and make sure it's the way you want it. If you have to size it down some so it'll fit, you just play with it exactly how you want it to be. Lord. It can be very sensitive, so depending on the type of computer that you have. Okay, once you have this placed where you want it to go, you want to highlight that area. Then you want to flatten it. When you flatten it, you will see you should only see everything combined. Once you flatten it, you should see everything combined. This is the screenshot again of um, my uh, template that just gives me an idea of my placement. So I'm going to hide that. Then I'm going to move it up. And four, two by five, um, four, five by two business cards will fit on Four will fit on one sheet of paper. You can use cardstock to print out. I'm not going to print this out, but uh, you can use cardstock to print this out once you get everything duplicated. So I'm going to duplicate it for you guys so you can see. I'm going to duplicate it again. And so I'm going to move them down so you guys can see. And once I have that where I want it to be, I'm going to, as you can see, it's loading. And once you get to make, you have to wait for a minute because it takes a while to load. You'll see that your business cards are printing, will print out. Again, you can do your copies up here. Um, you can say how many you want once you get there and then once you get to this point it's going to say continue and the printer that you have hooked up to it you can send to print of course i don't have anything attached to it at this moment so you wouldn't be able to see that and again here you go so it'll give you the option to print mine will be on my hp and I'll just hit print and my cards will come out and I can cut them accordingly. Also, if you have a scoring set, you can score your lines so that they'll actually print out themselves. But this is just a basic tutorial on how to create a simple business card using your design space. Thank you guys for tuning in to Selena's Way. Click subscribe and thank you for tuning in again. Bye guys.